People ask me how I can reconcile being a Christian first and a scientist second. Well, if one doesn't have a reverence for a divine creator after studying the brain for almost half a century, he has more important things to learn than neuroscience, in my opinion. Firstly, we'll never fully grasp the complexities of the brain. It's the black box of the body, unlike the pump, the heart, or the filters, the liver, the kidney, the spleen, or the oxygen exchangers, the lungs, and their biochemistries. Our understanding of the brain's anatomy and neurochemistry is truly primitive. With that observation, I can confidently say, without reservation, after studying neuroscience for the better part of 48 years, that the brain is irrefutable evidence that we're a creation and not a gradually progressive accident. The brain has to be God's crowning achievement in creating the human body, albeit not quite so evident in politicians and lawyers. That's what I call the, the argument from personal incredulity. The man says, I don't understand it, therefore God did it. That's pathetic. Uh, if you look at brains, nervous systems throughout the whole animal kingdom, you'll see a, a, a really continuous gradation. Of course, it's not really evolution. They're all living creatures today. But you can see you start with cnidarians, with sea anemones, and you have just a diffuse neural network. And then you go on to worms that have a sort of ganglion and a nerve cord. And then you go on to, to, to fish, which have a, a, a relatively small brain. Um, Amphioxus has an extremely small one. Um, and as you look at the vertebrates, you can see a continuous gradation of brains getting bigger and bigger and bigger, starting off, as I say, just a ganglion at the head of the spinal cord and then getting bigger. So we've got it before our very eyes. We, see, we can see how it would have evolved. Uh, brains don't fossil on the whole, fossilize, but you can see um, the brain case in fossils as well. So as I say, it's the argument from personal incredulity, and it's deeply unimpressive.